Hi everyone, uh, out at the field today uh, doing a bit more field testing. Uh, a little bit of a change of pace today, uh, not uh, testing a quad racing motor. Um, this is the uh, very inexpensive and popular uh, 2212 5T 2700 kV motor. Um, I picked this one up from Gearbest. Uh, you can also get them uh, plenty of places on eBay. Um, I've also bought some from Banggood, but the one from ones from Banggood were uh, were really crazy. They pulled way, t I mean, they produced a lot of thrust, but they were pulling like well over 40 amps um, and ran extremely hot. Um, I'll have some links down below. I wrote up a blog post on a bunch of bench testing I did, uh, as well as links. Uh, RC Plane Pirates done, uh, I think, a couple of test videos uh, testing this uh, motor on quite a few different props and uh, different batteries. So uh, we got a bit of a breeze here today, but uh, we'll give it a whirl. Uh, so I'm running actually also the uh, Hobby Wing Platinum Pro 40 amp speed controller, uh, which uh, is giving uh, about, I think about 5% more um, power than the Turnigy Plush, which is what I've run this motor with uh, in the past. So right now this is the uh, 6x4 APC gas. And then I'm going to run it with the uh, 6x4 uh, KMP, which uh, produced a little bit better numbers on the bench here. So uh, launching with a bit of a tailwind, which is not always the smartest thing to do, but... And we're away! <laughs> Ooh, there we go. Okay, get the speed up here. They're lined up for a pass. So I've only run this motor with the 6x4 APC gas with my RC Powers F18 version 5, which is not quite as fast as this uh, MiG 35B. Um, but she's uh, she's skipping along quite well. In the F18, I was running the uh, the Turnigy Plush 40 amp speed controller, which, like I said, uh, whoa. <laughs> Rock and roll here in this breeze, but it's uh, you know it's really ripping along nicely here. You know, very uh, and it's really really quiet because uh, you know I had built this plane for using quad racing motors, so the prop is is uh, almost completely centered in the uh, in the prop slot. So it's running, uh, you know, considerably more quiet than it has with quad racing motors, where the <laughs> where the prop has been much closer to the uh, leading edge of the prop slot. Okay, so we're into the wind here right now. So, whoa! <laughs> this motor has, uh, you know, it's it's got uh, pretty pretty decent torque. The 22.12.6. Whoa! There was a bit of a gust. 22126 uh, size, you know, so it weighs uh, exactly the same as the 22126 uh, 2200 uh, motor, which you know is probably the most popular uh, park jet motor around. But uh, you know, produces produces about five or six ounces more thrust, uh, you know, with with the same prop as a, as the 2200 would. Uh, it draws. Uh, considerably more amps. Um, all right, so let's see if we can't get her close here for oh, one more pass. Boy, she's getting bounced around in that wind. All right, time to bring her home in one piece. Oh, nice. Okay, folks, so there's the uh, the 2212 5T 2700 kV motor, 6x4 APC gas prop, um, Hobby Wing Platinum Pro 40 amp speed controller. So uh, I'm just going to stop the camera now, swap to the uh, 6x4 KMP prop, um, which produces uh, on the bench produced about 45 grams more thrust at full throttle. So, uh, you know, it might be hard to tell with this wind, but uh, we'll, we'll give her a go. So we'll be right back. All right, folks, uh, so we swapped out props. Uh, now I've got the 6x4 uh, KMP. Picked this one up from uh, Banggood. It's, uh, it's actually a black prop. It looks a little sort of gray there because I, uh, I have been using um, RC Plane Pirates uh, technique for balancing props. So 
uh, I had to sand, uh, there was super glue on there and then I had to sand it a little bit to get it balanced uh, correctly but uh, yeah it's working working really well. Um, so yeah here we go uh, again uh, 2212 5T 2700 motor hobby wing 40 amp speed controller uh, not the same battery but uh, it's the same brand uh, Gen Zace 2200 3 cell 45C so I'll just wait for a bit of a breeze here a bit of a gust go by all right whoa <laughs> Ooh, not liking that tailwind. All right. So uh, yeah, on the bench, uh, I want to say again, I, I apologize. Bit of a senior moment. I forgot to write all these numbers down uh, before coming to the field. So I don't know, uh, just with my naked eye here right now, I don't know that it's that it's a whole lot faster. <laughs> Too fun. I haven't flown in the wind here in a while, so it's taking me... Uh, but it's probably good for you guys because I'm probably not yapping as much. I'm re trying to focus more on flying. <laughs> so one thing I have noticed though is that you know these, this motor, um, after the uh, the six by four EPC gas flight, even though it's only uh, it's about four degrees, I guess thirty seven. Fahrenheit. Um, the motor is actually a little bit warm, which uh, you know, if we were in the midst of summer here with uh, you know mid to high 20s Celsius, would be something to uh, to definitely keep an eye on. Uh, this this Hobby Wing uh, um, Platinum Pro Speed Controller certainly lets this motor wind up uh, a bit more than the Turn G Plus did. So. Um, you know, with with more power, unfortunately, uh, uh, normally brings brings more uh, amp draw, which then ends up, uh, you know, you got heat. Uh, perfect timing here. I'll just do one more rip by and. Whoa! <laughs> Lucky. <laughs> I thought the wind was putting that right at my head. <laughs> Whoa, not the smoothest landing in aviation, but we'll take it. Okay, so let's just, uh, we'll just unplug the battery here real quick so I don't do anything, anything goofy to myself. There we go. Yeah, motor's a little a uh, little warm. It's really uh, really really warm right here at the uh, at the base here. So, you know, that's normally a, just a function of uh, very cheap bearings. But you know, this motor, uh, I think I paid right now. It's listed at on Gearbest for about six dollars and forty cents or something like that, American. And I think I've seen it as cheap as like five dollars, maybe even on eBay if you shop around. Um, but uh, you know it's inexpensive, uh, inexpensive power. They do tend to run. Uh, you know my experience with all of them, they do tend to run uh, a little bit hot. Um, and then, you know than some other motors, but you know you, you get what you pay for. Um, I've I've had some of them. I've run uh, you know hundreds of flights on, and uh, they you do you can tell they like this one I've run actually quite a bit. The this sort of copper gold color stuff here it starts to sort of fade a little bit uh, probably from from the heat but uh, yeah what the heck um, you do have to uh, provide your own connectors um, uh, you know it doesn't come with those um, so yeah there's the hobby wing uh, platinum pro um, yeah I'm very very impressed with it uh, with it thus far um, <clears throat> 
Yeah, working working really really well. So yeah, folks, uh, lots of uh, lots of links uh, down below, including to uh, you know the bench testing results with this motor. Some some uh, interesting results there. Um, so based on today's field testing, uh, you know, please please leave your comments for me down below. Let me know what you thought uh, was the faster of the two. Uh, I didn't see a whole lot of difference in speed, but uh, you know, maybe uh, another set of eyes looking at it, you can let me know. Again, it's a little tough to tell with the wind. You know, it could be uh, could be getting all the good strong tailwinds on uh, on the the gas. Uh, 6x4 EPC gas uh, runs, which made up for maybe a little less thrust, but I would say they're they're pretty pretty equal. And I'll check the numbers. Um, I think they were pretty equal on amp draw too. So around 35 or so amps. Uh, yeah. So um, there we go, folks. Uh, thanks thanks very much for watching. Bit of a bit of a prop uh, prop showdown there. Uh, lots of fun. Uh, you know, the, you never know until you bring these things out to the field and test them. Sometimes. Uh, where they fit in with uh, respect to the uh, bench numbers. So thanks very much for watching. Uh, we're blessed to have some beautiful blue sky today. And Park Jet Noise, the other sound of freedom, baby. Take care.